Hi guys! So today I have a very exciting video since I am doing another techno series episode and I know you guys love those videos so freaking much so I'm very excited to present to you guys the video on where I get my funds from but da -dun! So, where do I get my fonts from? All of my fonts are from this website called DaFont D-A-F-O-N-T dot com I hope I spelled that right. This website has a bunch of fonts and you can find like any style that you want from shapes to type like typewriter like fonts to just titles that look amazing and you can just find anything you're looking for. Honestly, you can find anything here. Now, how do you download these fonts? You literally just click on download. Once you click it, it's gonna download to your computer and then you're gonna have to open it, click on it, and click on the .ttf file. Once you click on this file, you'll just have to click install font and it'll automatically install in your computer. For your fonts to appear on your programs, you should close your apps and then open them again and your font should be there. So, now I'm gonna let you guys know which fonts I use in my videos, which is something a lot of you are probably wondering. Maybe not, but I'm still gonna tell you. My favorite fonts are Bebas. This is one of my favorite fonts. I use it so much, especially in my intros, and I just think it's just so pretty and like classic at the same time. So, this is the first font I use. Another one that I love using is Summer Soul Script. This font I feel is so like curly and like girly like and it just has a little bit more spice to it. <laughs> My next font is called Royal Acid. And this one is more like a biker type font. Uh, so you can use this for specific videos and just for cool titles, so yeah. Another one that I think is just super essential is called Travel Typewriter. And this is for like any type of typewriter things that you're doing. Another one that is perfect for the summer right now is called Palm Beach. This one literally represents the beach and the summer and the palm trees. So this one is the one that you should be using right now for your video. So another thing you can do with fonts is getting arrows or shapes to use in your videos. So I don't know if you guys have realized that a lot of times in my videos I use arrows that just like go down like this or go on the sides or shapes that just like appear in the middle of nowhere and then I put text inside. Well those are actually fonts as well. So how that works is that for each letter, a shape or an arrow is going to represent it, basically. So if you write A, this is the arrow you're going to get. Or if you write C, this is the arrow you're going to get. So the fonts that I use in the font for this specific purpose are Arrows TTB. <laughs> so this is one of the fonts that I use and these are some of the arrows that come with it. Another one that I enjoy using in my videos is PW New Arrows. So this one, instead of just being completely just arrows, it has terms and shapes, which is pretty cool because then you can use it for other things, not just for pointing at stuff. So the font I use to make circles or squares to appear behind the text or behind images or stuff is called Peaks web design circles so you can look that up in the font and these are the type of things you're gonna get and then for making other symbols like YouTube Instagram Twitter symbols all those logos you can use this font right here which is social logos very self informative with the title so this font right here is gonna give you all of these logos that you can use at the end of the video, at the beginning of the video, the middle of the video for whatever you want. And then another one that I use for logo type stuff is called social type. And I actually like this one a little bit more because it's like circles, like circle logos, which I personally find more appealing and pretty than the other one. 
So that's basically the fonts I use during my videos and to do my thumbnails. I just think using these fonts are super cool and important because then you can make your videos look so much better and people are just gonna be like, well, you know how to edit so much better just because your fonts look better too. And make sure to check out my other techno series episodes if you guys have a channel because I have a few of those and they definitely give you some tips for starting a channel. So if you want to check that out, I'm going to leave a link to the playlist down below. I hope you guys enjoy this and of course leave me uh, suggestions down below of things you want to see in my next techno series episode. Make sure to subscribe as well so you know whenever I upload another video. I post videos every Tuesday and Friday. And uh, that's basically it. I love you guys so, 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 so much. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye! Waking up, I'm taking chances tonight. I'm opening my eyes and I'm feeling.